crazy. I went to the Cadillac dealer here in Dallas and I said, I want a new Cadillac and I want it colored pink. The car dealer said, Mary Kay, custom painting a car is really difficult and I'm not sure you're going to like this color. And I said, no, I want it pink, please. Well, when she got her pink Cadillac and she drove it to the Mary Kay headquarters, all the sales directors went wild. So they started going to the same Cadillac dealer and saying, we want a pink Cadillac like Mary Kay's pink Cadillac. Let's talk about the choice of pink, the iconic pink. People think so highly of the company and of the brand that whenever they see the car, it just brightens their day. The, the pink paint is exclusive to Mary Kay. It goes back to the first vehicle that Mary Kay purchased. It's a symbol that people recognize. When they see the car, they start asking some questions or thinking about it. I get stopped by women that say, wow, I really like that car. Where did you get it? And I tell them, you know, this is Mary Kay. Para mí, el color rosado de Mary Kay significa pureza, eh, una mujer eh, que sabe lo que quiere. I think it represents a successful woman. To me, growing up in a Mary Kay environment, it was confidence. I believe that this beautiful pink Cadillac represents a legacy that we continue on with, and it really represents all the lives that we get to touch. This Cadillac is so much more than me or you. It's about so many more people that played a part in me driving this beautiful pink car. When the Cadillac dealership calls and says, we have your pink Cadillac here waiting for you, the first time was like, ah! When you go to pick up a pink Cadillac, they have it covered with a beautiful satin cover. And when you pull that drape off, there is magic. It's awesome behind that pink wheel. ¿Cómo me voy a sentir manejando un Cadillac? Me siento sumamente feliz. You just feel like you can conquer the world with it. I drive this car with such pride, thinking that Mary Kay is sitting next to me. That's why we don't honk our horns or cut anyone off. <laughs> I came home from the hospital in a pink Cadillac, and uh, it's been the car I watched my brother go to prom in. I watched the homecoming queen and the parades ride in this one. It's a constant symbol throughout my life is that pink Cadillac and it's a dream of mine that when I have kids I get to bring them home in a pink Cadillac too. When you're in your Cadillac and the music comes on, sometimes it makes you forget what you had to do to get there. But you're constantly reminded that it is an honor, that it is a privilege, and that this is a car that is respected. It makes me pretty emotional when we first came in here it took my breath away because I just thought, oh my gosh, it's so much more than a pink Cadillac. To be able to sit here next to Mary Kay Ash's pink Cadillac means the world to me because she has changed my life. I think that the message that it sends is so powerful and impactful. It is a voice of a company that has been built to enrich the lives of women. It says it strong, it says it loud, and it says it kindly, that these women are changing lives. And because of that, because of their courage, because they built their confidence, they have a choice of pink that no one else has. I think it was brilliant the way that they told the world that this is special and you will never ever, ever forget it. All right, everybody. Well, welcome to our amazing Thursday sharing event. Thank you for being on. I hope you enjoyed that amazing video of the history of Mary Kay's Pink Cadillac. Well, we have 
a very amazing speaker for you all tonight. But before we get started, I want to welcome all the amazing guests who are on it. I don't know how you got on. Maybe your consultant has invited you for 16 weeks and you finally said, okay, if I come to one thing, will you stop bugging me? And that would be a yes. Or, or maybe, I don't know, maybe it'll be a no. Um, or you are like, I want to find out more. Or you just were running around on Zoom and here you found us. So either way, we're just grateful. I don't think you can do that. But anyway, we're just grateful that you're on here tonight. And please do yourself, do yourself a favor. Put your name in that chat section who invited you tonight. Because we're giving away lots of free product. So we're giving away a bunch of free mascaras and some extra things tonight. Someone's going to go away tonight with $50 in cash. Um, and then if at any time tonight you think, you know, I'm thinking that maybe I want to do Mary Kay, all you have to do is type in the chat section. And I've been watching that chat section. Some of you already typed in, I'm in for free. And if you type in, I'm in for free, we're going to give away three free opportunities to join Mary Kay tonight. So thank you for being on. My name is Janice Trude, and I'm a global national sales director for Mary Kay. I just got back from Europe. I was finally being able to go back to the country that I've been building for an entire 30 days. I was in Europe, which is great. Such a horrible place to build Mary Kay. Um, I have I have a consultant who came in with a, with uh, who's been in the background of, in the industry, and she came into Mary Kay um, during COVID, and in eleven months did forty seven thousand and ended up number eleven in the entire European region of almost one million people. She was just honored last weekend on stage completely blew her mind. She's the number one consultant in the Netherlands, which is Holland. And so we're excited for Esther. She did such a great job. And I'm just so grateful you're all on here tonight. I have been with Mary Kay for 39 years. Yes, that's a long time. I came in when I was two. No, I was actually 22. So you can run the math on that one and figure out that one yourself. So thank you for being on here tonight. And I know that you came to hear some more about Mary Kay. So a couple of quick things I wanted to share with you before we have our amazing speaker on here tonight is I want to share some things with you. So let's just go to some screen shares here first. Um, this is our beautiful world headquarters in Dallas, Texas. You know, all of our products are made in Dallas, Texas, and then they're shipped to different distribution centers and many of our countries. We are in 40 countries currently. This is our beautiful Mary Kay. We started this company actually this month. 58 years ago. You know, one of the great things about Mary Kay Cosmetics is we've been around a long time and we have tested the times. We have many awards and accolades out there, including 1,500 patents on our products. We did lose our dear Mary Kay in 2001, but we are still a family owned and operated business today with Mary Kay's son, Richard, and Mary Kay's grandson at the helm of the company making decisions. And then, of course, Myself as a national sales director and Don, who's on here this evening, also helped make the decisions of the company. So we are so grateful. People often ask me, so how has it been during the pandemic? Are you kidding me? I have never been so busy. And Don will tell you, I don't think I've ever worked this way. You know, what the pandemic did is it pushed us into a place that we should have gone to a long time, and that's the virtual world. So now instead of getting together with four or five women and teaching you skincare, we're going to patch you out some samples. And we're going to have 45 or 450. The most I've had in a virtual event is 780. That's a lot of people all across the United States and in other countries we can do this. So if I was to ask you what state you're from and do not tap in the chat section, my poor girl will go crazy. But we probably cover at least 30 states tonight. And so our company has absolutely exploded. We've broken more records this last year than ever. So if you are on here tonight, let's get to a few facts because I know some of you are like, okay, give me the information. So, and Don will tell you too, when Don and I came into Mary Kay, we bought a starter kit. Now, 39 years ago, I will tell you mine did look as nice as this, but it was a starter kit. And you got, uh, you have over $481 worth of product in here, your trays, your mirrors, your CC creams, two sets of skincare, all, everything there for $100. This is how we came in. Today, the only requirements come in is your $30 e-start. Now, your $30 e-start gets you your entire website for a year and gets you all your credit card processing. But I will tell you, as our world is opening up, I think you need to consider the 30 plus the starter bag because you need that, okay? So I'm just gonna share that with you. And we are giving away three e-starts tonight also. So with that comes your beautiful website. And people are so funny. I don't know how to create a website. Let me tell you, you don't have to. You go in after you join Mary Kay and you answer a few questions, a few clicks, and all of a sudden, up, boom, your website is there. So people can shop online. 
They can check out online. They can see your product. They can go and do virtual makeovers on here, all kinds of things that you can do on here. So you can, you can have this website up. You can also text it out on an e-catalog to your customers and friends. If you are not local to your consultant, she'll have it drop shipped right to your door. So this is your beautiful website designed for you. Now, I don't know about you, but I don't know where you can start a business for $30. I mean, I've never seen that in my entire career. I mean, my starter kit 39 years ago was 65. So, I mean, I don't know how you all get 30, but hey, you know what? Take it. It's $30. So with that said, I do want to share also, too, that we have a lot of great things that some of you might be interested in today. Mary Kay has a program called Pink Doing Great. It's because it's Mary Kay's promise to create and maintain a sustainable business practices where we preserve and beautify our communities globally. So we have planted more than one million trees around the world. We have a recycling, robust recycling program. We recycle all of our bottles and jars and all of our compacts are made with recyclable uh, plastic. We have zero landfill status, which is really, really huge. So we keep up very much with the environment. And we're also a company that gives back. We've given over $50 million in grants to keep domestic violence shelters open in the United States. We've also given $28.4 million in grants to cancers affecting women. In our European regions, we've given over $80 million to help change the lives of women and children in our orphanage program. So we are not only a company that keeps up with the times, but we also do keep up with um, the environment also too. And I'm sure many of you might have seen us in many publications. You know, we have been on Good Morning America so many times, thanks to our amazing Luis Costco, who is a great makeup artist out there. But we have had great articles and um, great notoriety with Bazaar. Allure has done a lot for us. They've done uh, so many great articles for us. Um, Cosmopolitan has done a lot for us. Better Homes and Gardens and many Latina publications. So all of those have really, really helped us to move forward in this business. So before we have Dawn speak really quickly, I wanna open up to the gallery view really quickly here and say hi to all of our Mary Kay Beauty Consultants. So if you are a Mary Kay Beauty Consultant, can we see you wave? Where's all of our Mary Kay Beauty Consultants out there? There they are. And then we have a program where you, if you have three or more people on your team and you can start earning a car. If you have three or more on your team, will you wave? This is our red jacket program. Where are all of them? Okay, let's see them. They even have pom-poms. I see your pom-poms now, Rochelle. She's got pom-poms now. She got excited about that. And then our beautiful sales directors. Many of them are in their director suits. So let's see our beautiful sales directors who are out there. Thank you for joining us this evening. And while I did want to share with you that, because I also want to share with you that many of them are driving one of several cars. And we switch cars all the time. These are our current cars that you can actually earn in Mary Kay. So you have the Grand Achiever car. And if you're a part-time Mary Kay beauty consultant, you can earn this car. They pay your tax license and 95% of your insurance. And this is a great, I have seen more people come in during the pandemic and in 30, 60 or 90 days be driving a free car. Um, of course, you all know about the iconic Cadillac, but we also have other cars in our fleet too. There's, there's all kinds of cars that we have. So I just wanted to say, if you are looking for a car, um, it's definitely an, an opportunity. I just picked up my 19th pink Cadillac and no, all 18 are not in the driveway piled up with it. People always say, what do you do with them? And usually what I want to say, sometimes it's guys who ask me that question. I said, well, they're all in my driveway. If you'd like to come pick them. No. So we actually take every two years, we take our old car. How many of you would like to have a new car every two years, the rest of your life? I have not had car insurance or had a paid for a car since I was 22 years old. Oh my gosh, so long. All right, well, we have an amazing speaker and I want to get to Dawn because she has some great things that she wants to share with you. So if you're a guest on here tonight, don't forget, we're giving away a lot of free products. So stay to the end and somebody is getting $50 in cash and we're giving away three free e-starts. So if anytime you guys hear anything tonight, type in, I'm in for free and you'll be in the drawing for the three free e-starts, okay? All right, well, 35 years ago, Dawn was 23. Run the math on that one too. Um, she was engaged to be married to Larry, living in Cleveland and working 60 plus hours a week in a retail management training program that she was recruited for out of the University of Michigan. The Mary Kay product line was introduced to her by a new consultant who was asking her to be a face model for a Mary Kay portfolio. Dawn had a Mary Kay makeover and fell in love with skincare. She attended a Mary Kay recognition event. And at that event, she saw a woman 
who were in, and explicitly excited about sitting on thrones and wearing crowns and sashes. She was impressed by the income potential, but most of, of all fell in love with the culture of the women, encouraging and supporting um, each other to the best visit. She bought her starter kit that night and the rest is pretty much history. The last 35 years have been spent traveling globally all around the world with the exception of a small year last year, um, which we all know about. We've all kind of been sequestered. Uh, but in the last uh, 35 years, Dawn has built her business being single, married, having babies 24 months apart, C-sections, no local family, two open heart surgeries, and her husband, who's a federal agent working lots of crazy hours, sports, two kids through college, debt-free, and one dream wedding for her daughter uh, and son-in-law. And her daughter is a beautiful pink Cadillac director. Um, Dawn has her highest check in excess of $30, $33,000 in one month. I'm not sure how many Cadillacs you've earned, but you can probably share that one. So, and I don't know where our millions are there, but we'll just make it up five, six, something like that. Is it five? four, three, one, no, seven. I don't know. So Dawn's lost track of all of her money, which is a good thing. So anyway, please give it up for my dear friend. Love her to pieces. I feel like I've talked to you all day today. Dawn, Dawn uh, Sweeney. So Dawn, take it away. Thank you. Thank you, Janice. Um, those of you who are in Janice's area may not know this, but this format that she has for her sharing event has been copied all over Mary Kay Cosmetics. I did an event for Elaine Williams and Bridget Shaw last week, and they were guest speakers with Janice, and now they use it. So when Janice share, has a national on, she gives everyone all her resources. And, you know, I loved that about Mary Kay from the very beginning, because when I graduated from the University of Michigan Business School, like the people, the peers that I had, if you even asked them to turn a paper in for you, they looked at you like you were, you know, asking to commit a crime. Like, no way, because it's so competitive. Everyone is protecting their job security and their promotability. I love in Mary Kay that by Janice sharing how, you know, she shares this opportunity in such a professional, fun, that whole Cadillac thing, I was so excited. As a guest, I would have signed up all over again just watching that Cadillac video. You wouldn't even have to tell me how much it was, how do you make money? It's like, I want to be part of this. I want to be part of something exciting. And in this day and age, oh my gosh, how many women want to be part of something exciting, something hopeful, something positive, something encouraging, something not fearful? You know, really, turn on the news if you want to be scared. Don't be scared about buying a $130 starter kit to teach women how to wash their face with the number five largest global beauty brand in the world. Seriously, there are some scary things out there that you may want to be scared about, but building a Mary Kay business and being successful at it should not be one of them. When they were sharing on that video, 23,000 women have earned pink Cadillacs. I remember being at a guest event, like many of you are at a guest event. Some have already said all in, which is so exciting. Um, so now you're going to know what you're really all in to. For the guests that don't know yet, you know, if you want to say all in or not, you guys, I thought that night, 35 years ago, if I walk away from this, even though I don't have the $100 in my checking account, um, I had to write a post-dated check, which legally you can't do now with electronic banking, but so you're gonna have to get creative. If you don't have $130, you need to figure out where to get $130. Because if I wouldn't have figured out how to get $130 to start my business 35 years ago, I still may not have a way to get $130. Do you guys know what I'm talking about? Jobs only pay you so much money. Cost of living is up right now. Inflation is high. So that means your dollar goes less far. That means that what you're making goes less far than it did five years ago. So if you didn't have $100 then, you're definitely not gonna have $100 now and interest just keeps accruing on the credit cards and life continues to get more expensive. You guys, if there's anything about this business, if you're a consultant, you should have your running shoes on. Running, what Janice is talking about, that in you know my 35 years, her 39 years, I've it's been it was the best year I've ever had. 
And that's so ironic to me because we were not the company that promoted virtual businesses at all. But it's because we didn't know, we were forced in the pandemic how to do virtual the Mary Kay way. Because how virtual is done with other companies, there's nothing wrong with it, but they're selling stuff. They're using social media to throw enough products up there and sell stuff and build a sales force of people that get their stuff at cost. And you guys, there's nothing wrong with that. But that's not why Mary Kay created this. She created this so that you could serve women through this product. You could help them feel better about themselves by educating them and teaching them how to take care of their skin. And then if this business was something that appealed to them, teaching them how to build the business. And so if you're a guest going, I don't know how to build a business. I don't know anything about cosmetics. I'm not outgoing. I'm not a salesperson type. Perfect. We're going to teach you how. Um, you know, it is the business opportunity right now is better than it was when I signed up 35 years ago. Better. You can build faster and stronger. I've seen women come in in the pandemic and earn, like Janice just said, earn cars in 90 days, become directors in 90 days, all virtual. Now, some places are open more than others. So you do, I think the $130 kit is the ticket. You can do business virtually or in person. You can do QVC style. You can do samples. You can do Facebook Live. You can do Zoom. I mean, literally, you have the flexibility to work from a small town or a large town and not be limited by the amount of people by you. You can work as a director or national once you get approved internationally, like Janice is talking about. How exciting is that? You know, if you want to work internationally, you can earn the right to work internationally with Mary Kay and impact women all over this country, but all over the world. Um, one of the women um, that was talking about the Cadillac said, you know, I'm so grateful for Mary Kay because she's changed my life. And Janice and I were fortunate enough, we met Mary Kay. We went to her home for training. She was on the first trips that we earned as sales directors. You get her autobiography in your $130 package, and you want to read that. That's who you're representing. You're representing a woman who, instead of retiring after working for 25 years, chose to invest her life savings in a dream company for women that she felt filled in the gaps from everything she missed out on. A lot of times it's a single mom raising her family, losing her first husband, left her with three kids. The second one died right before she started this company and she started it anyways. And then Mel Ash, her third husband also passed away. Her daughter passed away in the process while she was building the company. You know, she had some women, her sales director force um, stood up and took the formulas and started beauty control back when the company was getting started. Mary Kay Ash was like all of us. She was a real life person and she did real life and she had a lot of discouragements and she had a lot of roadblocks, but she decided that what the dream that God had laid on her heart to help women be able to be paid what they're worth around the priority system of God first, family second, and career third was worth pursuing. Worth pursuing. I'm so grateful that she didn't decide to golf and watch TV in her retirement. I'm so grateful. There's nothing wrong with doing those things. But if she would have done those things versus doing this for us to have this, there would not be Mary Kay in 40 countries. And right now with 2 million women that just left the sales force because of the pandemic, some of those 2 million can't go back to what they did. Some don't want to go back to what they did. And Mary Kay is set up at the right place in the right time as we always have landed, ironically, but not ironically. Because Mary Kay told us that this company will continue on far after she's gone because she knows her daughters, which she called her sales directors and her nationals, would protect the three important premises that she founded this company on. One, the golden rule, we do business and you treat other people how you wanna be treated yourself. Two, she believed everyone was designed with the seed of greatness inside of them, and it's our job to encourage it out.
And third, she believed that her life always worked better when she um, built around the priorities of God first, family second, career third. So she gives us the ability to do that. You guys, Mary Kay was countercultural in the early 60s when this company started. The Vietnam War was going on. Women were burning bras. It was the whole freedom, you know, love anyone, anywhere thing. There was women were just getting into the workforce, but not a lot of opportunity. Lots of glass ceilings. It was very countercultural, this company um, and these priorities. And now it's as countercultural. Don't you agree? If you went to a job interview right now and told them, I'm a really hard worker, I'm a gritty girl, you know, I have a good work ethic, but my faith and my family are more important than my business, you probably wouldn't get the job. You, you may get fired for saying such things in the workforce these days. I, God knew when he put me in Mary Kay that I wouldn't do well being politically correct. And so I love that Mary Kay, you have to be 18, but you can be 100 years old. You can be white, brown, or black. Your skin color, your body shape, your education, your age do not matter. The thing that matters is that you have a desire to serve women through this product and this opportunity and that you're willing to be coachable. That's all we need, coachability and a willingness to serve women. And if you will do that, the pink Cadillac can be yours, six-figure income can be yours, financial security can be yours, but the culture, you know, when she said Mary Kay's changed your life, Mary Kay's changed my life. To be in association with women who have mentored me since I've been in my early 20s, to not only be successful in business, but to also be successful as a woman, as a mom, as a wife, as a Christ follower, which was something I was not when I bought my starter kit. I, my life's changed for eternity as my husband, as my kids. And that's the impact that Mary Kay has had all over the world. You guys, if you're a guest and you can leave this and say, you know what, it's not for me. Who do you know? You're on this for a reason. You could be in lots of different places right now. A lot of different places. Who do you know that your consultant needs to know? Who do you know that needs a support system like this? Who do you know that needs some hope and some fun? Who do you know that needs cash? Who do you know that needs upward mobility? You guys, there is room at the top. We need you to be a talent scout. If you are not all in, be a talent scout and be a hostess. Be a hostess for your consultant. She's got big goals this month. It's double credit. This is a big fat deal. September is a big fat deal. In honor of Mary Kay's anniversary, um, consultants and directors, you hosting a party is a big fat deal for her. But be a talent scout, because those two million women, you may know her and we don't. And I am so grateful that a consultant asked me to be a face model for her portfolio, invited me to a Mary Kay meeting in Cleveland, Ohio. And I am so grateful that I got my questions answered, so I made a decision based on fact versus fiction, because in my head, how I would have answered the how-to questions would have been fiction, because I had never successfully built a Mary Kay business, or I very easily could have made it on fear versus faith. So, you know, I always, Mary Kay always wanted us to be glad I did versus I wish, wish I had, and I would have been one of those women that would have wondered, could I have gotten one of those pink Cadillacs? I will order a new Cadillac, the Escalade, in December, and I don't know how many. I mean, literally, I've driven for free. The first was a Grand Am that I got when I think I was 25, and then my first Cadillac when I was 26, and I've been driving pink Cadillac since then. Um, my daughter, as Janice said, is a, a Cadillac senior sales director, and she earned her first car when she started at 19 as a college sophomore, because my son and her were sharing a car in college, and I guess not sharing very well, and I had made it real clear up front, I am not a car police, and so if there's any arguments and I hear about them, the car's coming home, because it's not a necessity. And so they didn't tell me, but she said, Mom, I need a car. So she started her Mary Kay business, and as a sophomore in college, living in a sorority house, um, and that wasn't an asset. People go, oh my gosh, that would have been a gold mine. It was not. Those girls were concerned about other things, not starting businesses, I can tell you um, for a fact. But she, in five months, earned a free car and became a sales director. 
And so she will, from 19 years on, never have a car payment or an insurance payment in her life. You guys, you can earn a car, Mary Kay, doing this business 10 hours a week around another job, around raising a family, around going to school, or around all three of those. Think of what just that, just having a free car, not having a car payment or insurance payment in your budget, what could that do for you? Having a car by Christmas? How about a debt-free Christmas? How about paying for someone else's Christmas? How about starting the new year with a totally different financial outlook than you have right now? Because you've gotten your feet wet this last quarter of 2021. Not to mention the tax deductions, and you don't have to have a baby for them. I'd much rather start a business than have a baby, especially at this stage of my life. But you guys, thank you for plugging in. Um, we, I'm going to stay in the chat and can answer any questions that guests have. But um, do know that you're here for a reason and a purpose. And you know, by the time you get off, if you're the person who invited you on, didn't set up a follow-up time, I want you to share with her what did you enjoy most. If you ever did start a Mary Kay business, what would the reason be? Share with her. Why do you think you'd be good at this? And what would hold you back from being all in? other than fear. Um, and then if it's not for you, when can you host a party for her? And who do you know? When can you host a party? And who do you know? You guys, if there's anything about it that grabs your head and heart, go for it. You have nothing to lose. I'm so grateful I didn't make a decision based on my bank account, what my friends and family said, um, and how scared I was. I really did not think that I had the right personality. I was scared to death but there was something about it that I couldn't say no to. And the fact of the matter is I had spent $130 on stupider things. And I think if you'll admit it, you have too. In fact, I had a lot of credit card debt to evidence a lot of stupider things that I had paid for. So Mary Kay has definitely helped me be a better financial steward and get out of debt and stay out of debt. And most jobs don't give you that opportunity. You're happy to have a job, but to change your financial situation for yourself and for generations is a rare thing, especially with the $130 start and no risk. So that is what I have to share. Um, Janice, do you want me to share anything else or start answering right, questions? Well, you, know, you, Madison, you have a very busy family life. Your husband's job and career, oh my gosh, I wish you would share that because just a, okay. just a piece of it, a minute of it. Okay, sure. So when you were reading my accolade, you said two open heart surgeries. Those, I haven't had two open heart surgeries. My son had to have an open heart surgery um, when he was three months old and 10 years old. My husband was a federal agent. And so when I started my Mary Kay business, he was going to training for 17 weeks. I was starting my business. And then he was stationed in Douglas, Arizona for 24 months. And then St. Simons Island, Georgia for eight years where I started to train um, federal agents. But you know, he did shift work the first 24 months. And, you know, it, it sounds kind of glamorous, a federal agent, but honestly, it was dangerous. And he was making $14,400 a year before taxes with a University of Michigan degree. Even in 1986, that was not enough money to make our car payments and our rent. And I had the visa bills that I came to the marriage with, as I kind of alluded to. And so I... It's been great to have this business because I could do a skincare class in Douglas, Arizona with a flip chart in Spanish and me not understanding a word of Spanish, take the cash because they were happy and get another party booked and go and buy groceries. Do a party, smile, flip, squirt, and take the cash and go and pay the electric bill or the rent. And so you can pay bills and make money selling this product when you make 50%. That helped, I could see my husband while he did shift work. It was a way for me to meet people because I, I didn't speak the language of three quarters of the city. Um, also too, it's, it, it's hard once you get out of school to meet friends for women. You tend to just know your neighbors, your coworkers, your husband's coworkers, wives, your kids, mother's friends. I love this because it's exposed me to women. Like I can go and offer a facial to someone that I meet at the gym that I like, that it's kind of weird to say, gosh, I just moved here and I need a friend. I mean, it sounds kind of needy and it sounds kind of weird and it 
may not work that often. But when you offer someone a facial, she'll sit down with you, she takes her makeup off, whether it's on screen or in person. You guys, women, when they take their makeup off, tell you everything. I was a psychology minor, thought about being a psychiatrist until I realized how long I'd have to go to college for. And I mean, really, I mean, women tell you everything. If you like women's ministry and you like working with women, um, I mean, this is a vehicle to do so. And then my husband, when he was asked to train, so literally the first 36 months of my business, we had nine addresses in four states. And in that time period, I did Queens Court of Sales, earned my car, Queens Court of Recruiting, became a director and earned my Cadillac. And we didn't have the internet then. We had phones attached to walls. I'm very jealous of what you can do. I'm jealous <laughs> of what you get in your starter kit. I'm jealous of the new consultant bonuses. I'm jealous of all the different cars. I'm jealous of the new director programs, all the cash bonuses you can get. I mean, the company has done everything they can to make this the best opportunity for women on the planet, financially, personally, professionally, spiritually, the whole deal. It's the total package. So my husband, um, at 10 years after being a federal agent, um, because of me building my business around his you know, crazy first 10 years, we I made enough income that he could leave a GS-14 position and pursue some of his dreams instead of working for a paycheck. And um, also too, as a federal employee, he was being asked to make decisions that were very against his value system and that was eating him up inside. And so since he's been in his early thirties, he retired, he was a manufacturer's rep for a while. The last 15 years, he's had a gym and he's a strength and conditioning coach for adults and youth athletes, which the youth athletes are his heart. He played football at Michigan, was a scholarship athlete, um, trained federal agents and their physical techniques too. And so he loves helping kids have the mindset of success if they really wanna be successful. And if I didn't do my Mary Kay business and in this pandemic in Michigan, his gym was closed for a long time. And mm -hmm. his, been, his gym business has been cut in half because of the people who are afraid to come back and work out. If I didn't have my Mary Kay business, our family's finances may not look too pretty right now. I'm very, very, very grateful for the sustainability of a Mary Kay business in any economy, at any age, in any you know time frame in our country. Once again, we celebrate 58 years, but we're not just surviving, we're thriving. It gives you an opportunity to be in charge of your family's finances versus your employer, the economy, the government, your spouse's employer. I mean, if you're one of those girls that likes to be in control, me and God wrestle with that a lot. But in some respects, being in control is a good thing, right? Yeah. You know, and I would much rather have putting food on the table and paying bills and putting my kids through school and where I live be up to me yeah. than my husband's employer or my own employer. I, I do like being the boss of myself. And Mary Kay gave us that choice and we get to be the boss of ourselves through service. Mary Kay said, you figure out your goals and then you figure out how many women you need to help reach theirs. You forget about yourself and go out there and serve. And that sounded odd to me after business school, but you know what? She really meaned it and it has worked and it continues to work. And if that appeals to you, we'd love to teach you how. Thank you, Dawn. Oh my gosh, such great information. You made my, my rest of my job and my evening very easy. Now I see a lot of information in the chat section before we answer questions. And some of the things that Dawn did mention, because I see some questions, is we have a level playing field. Everybody makes 50%. Nobody makes any more than anybody else. We all make the same. We don't make money off of each other. We're not a multi-level company. So we all make 50% profit on our sales. And the two things that I absolutely loved always about Mary Kay is there we have no quotas and no territories. I came in with a full-time job, going to school full-time, and did Mary Kay part-time, like many people do. So there's no quotas. Now, people often ask, how much do you have to sell every month? You don't. You don't make any money, but you don't have to sell. Okay, so let's be clear on that one. All right. And then you have no territories. Your territory is the United States of America, which used to be like 
okay, well, this is my state, but now with virtual, it literally clearly is the United States of America. And when you move into management, you do have those opportunities to go global. We are in many, many, many countries out there today, building very quickly in lots of different countries. So, which is really great too. And I, the reason I joined Mary Kay Dawn is because at the meeting, at the Mary Kay meeting with all the happy Mary Kay people, they said, you know, Janice, if you decide to get out of Mary Kay your very first year, any unopened product that you have, they'll buy back at 90%. So I thought, you know what? I don't know if I'd be good. I never wore makeup in my life. I was a tomboy. I have my college education, but if I don't try this, I'll never know with the buyback policy of nothing to lose. Now, I do want to ask the guests a question tonight. This is just for the guests. So if you'll play in participation in the chat section, if Don and I were to give you, um, yes, they still have the buybacks. I just saw that. Mm-hmm. If Don and I were to give you right now $20,000 in cash, we gave it to every guest on here tonight. We're not doing that, but just to pretend we are. Uh, if, if he did give you $20,000 each, um, may I ask what you'd spend it on if you had $20,000 right now in your hand and you had only 24 to 48 hours to spend it? Um, I'll take it. Down payment on a house. What would you guys as guests do with this? Okay, I see iPhone. I take it. Um, Maddie says down payment on a house. A house says Irma. Okay. What else would you, and how do I find the agreement to submit? Thank you, Amy. A house, car, pay off debt, pay off part of my house, a home. A lot of you, yeah, look at student loans, pay off bills. These are the dreams and the goals that you wish you could have. And if I could tell you, it could start with a $30 e-start and change your life in six months. Is it worth the $30? We will go out to dinner this weekend, probably with friends or family or whatever, house debt, payoff business, um, things for your grandkids. All these are great things. And you'll probably go to dinner with your spouse or significant other or even friends, and you'll spend more than $30 on a meal and that will be it. But if $30 on an e-start or $130 on an e-start and a starter kit can change the trajectory of your life, you know, I'm sitting here with looking at a $5 million plaque. I've earned, well, I probably spent it too. I've earned it. (laughs) Five million dollars so far in Mary Kay. Two college educations paid for, 19 pink Cadillacs, and I only came in to shut up the lady who was driving me crazy for three months. So you never know until you try with a buyback policy. You don't have anything to lose. Now I will open up for questions, but I will tell you one of the biggest questions I get is what does training look like? Well, let me just share with you this much. Training looks like differently for each person. So let's say Robin comes in and she says, you know, Janice, I love the product. I use clinical solutions. I use the repair set. I buy a lot. I just want to get my product at half price and put a couple orders in a year. I say, okay, Robin, great. That's a minimal training. Now, if Crystal comes in and she said, Janice, I need four to 5,000 a month. I need to walk away from my job. I do not like what I do. And I need a lot of money. Her training and Robin's training are two different paths of training. So communication is very, 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 very important that you let us know. Um, You let us know what you're looking for. Could you use a car? Could you use a thousand a month? Could you use 5,000 a month? You need to let us know and we'll put you on the training path based on that. Um, The $30 e-start gets you your entire website and all your credit card processing for an entire year. Then after that, I believe it's still on fact. Somebody to, to, to ask Tommy if it's not, it's $30 after that too for another year. Is that correct? Um, am I correct in that? Yes. Yes, I think so. So it's $30. And then you guys, it's design a website. Yes. Thank you, Diane. I need someone to be on top of it. Um, leave it to my sister to be on that one. Um, so, you know, I mean, it can be that quick. And it's so exciting to see Dawn's daughter, who I actually talked to today on here tonight, as a next generation. And that, that is so exciting also too. So I always tell people, you never know, what time, at what point did you start wearing the makeup? Well, hmm, yeah, so um, it, oh, do, I have actually a picture. Do you wanna see what it looks like? This is what I look like the week I joined Mary Kay. Can you all see this? I used to ride motorcycles and I was in, uh, riding my dirt bike and I dumped it. Yeah, so this was me at 22. <laughs> so it gives you hope, right? I always tell people, you guys, it's not rocket science. If you try this and you don't like it, nobody runs you over tomorrow on a big pink Cadillac. It's not that big a deal. But if it could change your financial future and your situation, would it not be worth it? I would probably say that 90% of the people who come into Mary Kay today work a full-time job and have very busy family lives. But the pandemic has changed our world so much. I don't think I've ever seen so many people make so much money. And that's so off of what the pandemic has done to so many businesses. 
But in Mary Kay, it's like Don says, we thrive. I mean, literally, I've never worked like this. My husband said, I've never seen you work like this. I has, I've never worked like this before. You know, when we pivoted, we were doing 13 to 15 vigil, virtual events. So we, I couldn't even keep up with it. It is so crazy. And to think that we can be where we are today, even when I was in Europe, I took my ring light, my computer and my tablet have ring light will travel. And I was, I was literally on events in Europe when I was, I was working backwards or forwards or whatever it is. So um, it, you'll never know till you try. And you all, I will just tell you with a buyback policy, you have nothing to lose. So if you're on here as a guest tonight and you decide, type in, I'm in for free. We're going to put you in the drawings for the three free e-starts. Your consultant and your director will take you all the way. Now, I will tell you, if you haven't walked into Michael's or Hobby Lobby lately, I hate to tell you this, but Christmas is here. And <laughs> I will tell you 177,000 employees were just added on to Amazon to keep up with the early demand because of product packaging and different situations this year and last year, people are ordering early and shopping earlier to make sure and ensure they get the products. So our consultants are already out there. Oh, I put my phone, phone things with Dave's away. Anyway, I'm um, already out there shopping and everything. So I will tell you, Jump in, jump on. It's a great time to be in Mary Kay. Okay. I see a lot of you guys saying I'm in for free, which is really, really great. So we're going to go on and give out some gifts tonight. So let me go to gallery view here. And as you know, we do two virtual events tonight. Don, you might think we're crazy, but we have uh, LaRonda Daigle on next also too for a virtual event. So if you guys want to hear us all over again with a different speaker, you're welcome to come back too. I know it's a little crazy on Thursday night, but I just want to say, all we had 101 on here tonight. We got 96 people on here tonight, which is really great. Um, and I just wanted to say that uh, we're going to give away some things. So Sherry Black, all the way from Texas to Iowa. Um, Sherry yeah. has been on my chat section for a year and a half, manning the chat section for a year and a half, and has never failed me. So I'm going to tell you, yay for you, Sherry. Okay. So first off, we're going to give away some mascaras. And would you do me a favor? Um, if your name is drawn, would you come off your microphone real quickly and just tell us where you're patching in from and one thing you heard tonight. So let's give away the first mascara. So um, Sherry, who gets the first mascara tonight? Uh, the first one is going to Irma, who is Rochelle's guest. Okay, Irma, if you were on tonight, you're Rochelle's guest. Will you pop off your microphone real quickly and tell me where you're coming in from? Hey, Irma, where are you? Got to be on here. Hey, Irma, come off your microphone. We want to hear from you. Hey, hey, Rachel, Rochelle, where is she? Is she here? She's here. She's on. Okay. I know you're dying to say something. Tell, tell us about your guest if she doesn't. So we're going to give her a second. Miss <laughs> Irma? Miss Irma. She's been, she's been texting me, so I know she's on. Um, okay. She's a dynamic woman, and I'm hoping she's in for free. Okay. Tonight. <laughs> All, right. All right, Rochelle. Well, well, I'll tell you what, since we can't see her yet, why don't we do, we'll just patch her out a mascara. You connect with her, okay? Make sure we get her address. Okay? I'm here. All right, Irma. Girl, where are you coming in from? I'm sorry. I talked before my turn. Sorry. Where are you coming in from, Irma? Where do you live? That oh. was that was Tammy. She's another one of my guests. She, that's not Irma. All right. <laughs> It's okay. We'll get it later. We'll get them all unconfused. It's okay. Michelle, we'll get her a mascara. It's good. All right. So who's the next mascara winner? Sorry, I was in the kitchen. Hey, Irma. Thank you for being on here tonight. Hey, what, where are you coming in from, Irma? I'm in Concord, California. And tell us one thing you heard tonight that you were most impressed with. Those cars and that $20,000. Okay. <laughs> Okay, Irma. Well, we're glad you're on here tonight. We're going to get you both of them. You just got to start, okay? Thank you. Okay, you're welcome. All right, next. All right, now let's go to the next one. Okay, so the second mascara goes to Bree, who is Alice Martin's guest. Okay, Bree, where are you this evening? If you are on, will you jump off your microphone real quickly and tell us where you're patching in from, Bree? I'm um, patching in from Fort Worth, Texas. All right, Bree, and tell us one thing you were pressed with tonight. Um, there's so much, uh, the catalog was amazing. The startup, the, all the bonuses, the fact that it's not multi-level, everybody makes what everybody else makes. 
you don't get to earn the buck by promoting people. It's the material that product that sells itself. Perfect. Well, thank you, Bree, for being on here tonight. We're going to patch you out of mascara. We hope you're in for free. Make sure you connect with your consultant, okay? Will do. Thank you. You're welcome. All right. Who's the next one? The third mascara goes to Laura Colton, who is Gail's guest. All right. Laura. Laura, Laura, Laura. Where are you, Laura? Hey, dear. Hey, Laura. Hello, Laura. I see you off your microphone. Speak, speak. All right, maybe she can't Can you hear me. Hear. Yeah, Laura. Hey, where are you coming in from, Laura? <laughs> hey, Laura, where are you coming in from? I am coming in from South Georgia. Okay, South Georgia. Tell us one thing you heard tonight that you're most impressed with. Oh, the cars, the money, the sisterhood, all of it. <laughs> okay, well, perfect. Well, we're going to patch you out of mascara. Make sure you connect with your consultant and hopefully you'll be in for free, okay? Yay, thank you. You're welcome, Laura. Okay, I'm going to do one more um, thing tonight. So let's do one more. We're going to do a liner, a black felt tip eyeliner, okay? I'm going to mark it down here and make you crazy tonight, Sherry. So go ahead and we have one more winner tonight before we give away our e-starts. Okay, so for giving away an eyeliner, that is going to go to Carol, who is Lori Lagerstrom's guest, and I think she's on with Lori. Okay, Carol, if you're on here tonight, come off your microphone. Yeah. Hello. Hey, Lori, where are you coming in from? Um, I'm from Davis, but Lori's in Woodland. Okay, so. thank you, Carol. What did you hear tonight? What did I hear tonight? Huh? Uh, what most impressed with? Yeah. Um, I guess um, I appreciate that it's not a pyramid kind of organization. I thought that was impressive and okay. that it's the way it's set up. Perfect. Well, we're going to patch you out a liner and make sure you connect with Lori, okay? Thank you. You're welcome. All right. So here goes the three free e -start. So how this is going to work, you guys, if you typed in for free. And I just want to say I saw a lot of people type in for free tonight. And even if we don't pick your name, good night, you guys. What a great opportunity. Just get in. Don't worry about it. But for those of you who do, we do pick tonight, we're going to do three I'm in for freeze before we give away $50 in cash. But if you do do this, you need 48 hours to connect with your consultant and get signed up. And then she will reach out to her director who will reach out to me and will reimburse you back for that. Okay. Very important information there. Okay. So who's the first brand new Mary Kay Beauty Consultant, Sherry? Okay. So the first free e-start is going to Linda Fixon, who is Belinda's guest. Okay. Linda, if you are on here tonight, will you pop off your microphone real quickly? Hey, Linda. Hey, Janice. Hi. Off her microphone. Okay. Hey, Linda. She's talking. Hey, Linda. Where are you coming in from? From Oregon. Okay. Perfect. And what is one thing you heard tonight that impressed you the most? Love the fact it's not a pyramid. Okay. Perfect. Well, thank you for coming in to Mary Kay. Welcome to Mary Kay Cosmetics. Make sure you connect with Belinda and she'll get you started. Okay, Linda? I sure will. Thank you. You're welcome. All right. Who is the next brand new Mary Kay Beauty Consultant? So the next one is Su excuse me, Susan Jordan, who is Susan Swisher's guest. Okay. Susan Jordan, would you come off your microphone real quickly and let us know where you're coming in from? Hey, Susan. Hi, I'm coming in from Kansas City, Missouri. Okay, perfect. And what is one thing you heard tonight that impressed you the most? Making extra money and being my own boss. All right. Sounds good, Susan. Well, we want to welcome you to Mary Kay Cosmetics. Make sure you connect with your consultant and get signed up, and then we'll get you started, okay? All right. Thank you. You're welcome. All right. And who is the third e-start going to, Sherry? Uh, the third one, Janice, is going to Diane Baker, who is Laura Fisher's guest. Okay, Diane, are you on here this evening? If you are, pop off your microphone really quickly. I'm here. Can you hear hey. me? Yeah, Diane, it's great to see you. Where right. are you coming in from? Yankton, South Dakota. Okay. All right. We have people everywhere. I love it. Um, tell us, Diane, why you decided to join Mary Kay tonight. Oh, I just like the um, helping women, I think is the big thing. Okay. Women working together. Okay, perfect. Well, we're yes. going to get started and we want to thank you and welcome to Mary Kay Cosmetics. 
Thank you. You're welcome. All right. And Sherry, I'm not going to put you over the edge of this, but we're going to give away an extra e-start tonight. So I knew it. Janice, why do you do this stuff? Because I can. There we go. How's that? All right. It's not your money. Don't worry about it. I got it. Okay. Go for it, Sherry. Okay. okay. So in that case, then it uh, the fourth one's going to go to Deborah, who is Christina's guest. Okay, Deborah, Christina, girl, you owe me. All right, Deborah, I'm just kidding. All right, Deborah, where are you tonight? Where are you, girl? I'm here. Hey, Deborah, tell us real quickly where you're coming in from. Richmond, California. Richmond, California. And what did you hear tonight that made you join Mary Kay? So I can work my own hours and still make good money. Okay, perfect, Deborah. Well, you connect with Christina. She knows the drill. She's been with me for a year and a half doing this. These are my early girls who jumped on. So, all right, well, we're excited to you. For, welcome to Mary Kay. All right, now we're going to give away our $50. And before we give our $50 away, I always want to tell all the directors, thank you for supporting our events. It really does make a difference. We got October, November jam packed already with other speakers. Get ready. Um, and so uh, before we close tonight, Dawn, do you have any parting words for anybody? Hmm. Parting words. Okay. Consultants. I want you to figure out how to uh, maximize double credit. Co directors and consultants, figure it out. You got what? Nine days. Figure out how to max it out because in June, you'll be so happy you did. And guest, if you haven't already, if you set all in and you didn't win the drawing, know that that's who I was. I did not win the starter kit drawing that night. And it was not a sign that I wasn't supposed to do it. So go ahead, get your consultant number before your head hits the pillow so you do not chicken out. And the other guest, again, if there's anything about this that could serve you well, give it a shot. Get, I mean, get your stuff for free between now and the end of the year. You have a full year, you know, to um, make a decision even longer than that, really. It's, you know, one year from your last um, order that the 90% buyback is good for. Take advantage of the tax deductions, get your feet wet, um, and make a decision based on your own experience versus ours. But if not, would you please just book a party for your consultant to help her with her double credit and let her know who does she need to know? But thank you so much for joining us. And I do hope that, you know, all our guests leave knowing that there's so much more to Mary Kay than selling lipstick. And when you purchase the product, you're supporting another woman's dream come true. Thank Perfect. you. Thank you, Dawn. All right, here we go.